do that you figure it out. All right, all right. Um, FTM, DNC, man, a lot. Right. i speak on it. I'm going to do this little segment called You Figure It Out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I mean, shout out to my boy Alex. Yeah, yeah. Kwan. Yeah, you yeah. Love the um, boy. I, what I'm actually trying to figure out, well, actually, I'm trying to get you to figure out, is the things to me that are important, the things to me that really matter. I'm a type of guy that, if I'm gonna be your support system, am I, uh-huh. am I gonna be the positive, optimistic, you know what I'm saying, person that can be considered as your bad phone? And the things that I will need from you is your support as well. I mean, if you add negativity to my positivity, it's gonna create. <laughs> Wait a minute, do that again. Do that again. If you add negativity. Uh huh. It's gonna add strength. This is not a game. This is not a game. So, my thing is, is like Alex touched on, is love enough, man? You know, honestly, I feel like love should, love, does love conquer all and is love enough. I honestly feel like love mm. is something that is thrown around like the next fashion thing. Like, That's right. It's like people wear it like it's fashion. People say it like it's something that can just be said and roll off the tongue like it's a new language. You know, nobody's speaking French. So like, it's love. <laughs> Educate yourself. Um, my thing is, I feel like if I love you, then I should have it. I should be able to come to you and let you know what I feel is going to, within a relationship, is going to cause problems. That's because you, so could, you are the man. Because you communicate. And right? as a man, I'm, I'm leaving the relationship. That's right. And as a man, I'm coming to you. I'm not saying shit behind your back. I'm not saying fuck this shit, fuck her. I'm going to just do me. Right, you ain't being a child. Do me. Like, he does that. I'm going to do me. <laughs> do you, Coco. <laughs> do you. Real fuck. <laughs> do you, right. Oh, you know right. right. <laughs> um, but I'm just trying to, trying to figure out. Like, if I'm coming to you, and this goes out to every female that say, I don't really show my emotions, this is why. So, you figure it out. Ooh. Um, you figure out why I don't show my emotions. When a guy like me tells you, I don't like your attitude, I don't like how you respond to stuff, I don't like this, I don't like that, it's not that I'm complaining, I'm allowing you to know what's up here. Thank so you. So, it won't cover my what's down here. Oh. So, um, Ooh. That being said, I don't want you to feel like, oh, because you love me, you should be treating me like this. No. <laughs> because the simple fact of the matter is, I love you enough to let you know how I feel. That's when I that. tell you how I feel, you don't take in what I say into consideration. That's that fantasy right though. When they be like, since you love me, you should treat me like this. This is not a Get out of, right, right, right. You you are not living in Disney. Exactly. This isn't something that Shrek, you know what I'm saying, Fiona. Right, nigga, this ain't Cinderella. You know what I'm saying? So my thing is about that is, I tell tell many females, if you don't listen, you don't laugh. Oh! If you don't listen, you don't don't laugh. laugh. Exactly. So I don't tell that to many females that aren't here now. Because they didn't listen, and sometimes when you don't listen with this, you trying to, you trying to, you, I mean, you get disappointed with your heart. And that's one thing about me: I do not like being disappointed. Uh-huh. If you disappoint me, it is a problem because I feel like what you did was you took whatever actions and drawing your conclusions to whatever you wanted to, and then taking what I said into consideration or my feelings. So you disappoint me because I thought you were somebody that loved me. And uh-huh. You don't try to hurt me like that. Just like if I was to hurt you, you would turn around and say I disappointed you or I broke your heart. You know what I'm saying? So my issue is, you know, for you to figure out is when you don't allow me to be me by me telling you this is how I feel, this is what's up, I don't like your attitude. I'm I'm telling you I don't like your attitude or I don't like how you respond to stuff just because I want you to I want your love that you have to say, you know what, let me do something to change that. Let me, okay, you don't like my attitude, what about my attitude that you don't like? So let me try to help myself correct those things so we can live coexist in a relationship. That's so right. When that's being said, I need you to understand that I'm doing this as a man to present how I feel. Dog, women are scared of real men nowadays, dog. Um, they don't want a real man, man. They want that thug they see on BET, man. That thug they see on BET. Right, they don't want that real man, dog. That real man that'll sit down and tell you what's wrong and tell you how to fix things and, and tell you how we can live life. And then still say, and then say, and still say, how many got, 40 seconds? Nah, we, we about done. Five minutes, right? 
No, it's 10 minutes without. Oh, okay. What's up? Yes, yeah. sir. Yes, sir. I got 10 minutes right. without. Right, 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 right. We um, got five minutes. Yeah, see, my thing is, no, I want a female to understand that with me telling you how I feel, my grieving, I can be a fuck nigga or I can be a real nigga. Ooh. Or I can be a real man. Right. I can tell you, this is what I don't like, baby. This is what I don't like. This is what I need for you to do. And see. this is what we need to fix. And this is what we need to fix. You talk, you communicate, you compromise. Just like you say, the three C's. Christ, Preach. Christ, communication, compromise. In any relationship, if you can't come to a conclusion on a compromise, you agree to disagree and let that shit go. Thank you. Know you know what I'm saying? Because go I'm get a hamburger and laugh about it. Cool. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> because this is not a game. No, I'm trying to tell you, man. It's like... No, this is this is the church of FTM hey, right I'm now. You, you, man, you're I'm being schooled. I'm trying to Freak. tell you, man. I'm like, I know I have my thoughts, my attitude, my stubbornness, my spitefulness, my competition has attitude I have. When you show me attitude, my attitude feel like I gotta show you something bigger. Right. I'm, but as a bigger man, as a bigger person in a man, I'm gonna sit up here and say, you know what? Sometimes I gotta have an out of body. Sometimes I gotta walk away and then come back to the situation. Allow a person to sit up here and walk away from a situation. Like Walk away. So I feel like, man, let me just let me walk away, correct my thoughts, and then when the when the emotions aren't high, we come and sit down, but we sit on here and say, hey, another thing, don't hit me with that bullshit. I don't want you to text me no more. Don't text or call me no more. Don't do that. That's bullshit. No, that's that little kitty because stuff, man. You know that's not even how you feel. That ain't even how I feel. A real nigga slash man, man, man will sit up here and be like, you know what? Bump all that because the simple fact of the matter is I love you, you love me, we gonna make this shit happen. Dang on right. What talking about, baby. Busy. We, we in here together. That's we right. This, okay, this ain't gonna be something that's gonna hinder us. This ain't gonna be something that hinder us. Like I said, if you take your negativity and you bring it to my positivity, you create frustration. You know what I'm saying? So I don't wanna be frustrated over nothing. You know what I'm saying? Because the simple fact of the matter, I'm a dedicated, hard working, yeah. Uh oh, you know uh oh, the phone yeah. vibrated yeah. like hard like, got, like somebody oh, text somebody must just text my phone. Oh, in the video. you know what I'm saying? Because they already know. Because oh. they, they, they at first at one point in time they weren't talking, but now they communicate. Real, Real man. Real man. Real man. Because they know they don't want to lose something that they really fucking want. Mm -hmm. You don't want to lose nothing that you really fucking want. <laughs> Figure it out. So don't pretend. <laughs> don't pretend like this is what you want to do. I don't understand. So I'm like, dude, if you want me, if you want me. That goes to whoever want me. See, that's the thing right. is, whoever want me doesn't mean I want you. Figure Ooh. it out. So, Ooh. <laughs> you need to figure out who the fuck I want, then you got to ask yourself what it is that I'm doing for you mm -hmm. to make shit happen for you, for us. You know what I'm saying? So, right. This is what it is. I got many people that I love. I got many people. I mean, shout out to Bambi. Shout out to Coconetta. Shout out to Chandra. You know, I love my baby girl, Trinity, Cedric, Aaliyah. I mean, I got people I love. You know what I'm saying? It's just what it is, but the thing is, on a personal note, when it comes to my relationship, I feel like a strong man will lead his relationship to the promised land. That's right. What it's intended for them to have. And you know what? You're going to have ups and downs, but that's yeah, what... That's, that's what a relationship. Thank you. You're going to have ups and downs. That's ups and downs. There's going to be times when y'all lay next to each other and don't speak to each other. But I don't feel like you should go days when y'all are just... Like in the dark with each other on what's going on in your mindset. I feel like that's that's stupid. Right. Especially if you live together. Right. Especially if that you're trying have to have something. Uh -huh. Sometimes it feels like if you don't treat your relationship like a friendship first uh -huh. and a partnership second, uh -huh. and then you sit up here and live this thing. I feel like you got to make a conscientious decision to say, hey, I want to be here. If I want to sit up here and be here, I have to make steps to get here. If that's I, right. If I don't get there because I ain't made up in my mind, I want to get there, and then you do everything in your power to get there. You do everything in your power. You don't let nothing come in between you making them steps and again. If you want to marry me, if you want to marry, you want to be Mama Lockness. Uh -huh. You want to be Mama Lockness. You want to be Baby Lockness. And if you want to have one of my kids, or you want to sit over here and just hold my hand and say we're together and we walk in Wally, like right. oh my God, look at the Lockness with this with his girl. Is that your girl? Because they gonna want to know who is this chick. You know what I'm saying? You want to hang around the Lockness. You know what I'm saying? Just being around the Lockness. You know what I'm saying? Because trust me, there are plenty. You wanna sit up you wanna sit in here and be in a video and talk all that shit like, oh bitches, you know what I'm saying, just my nigga don't fuck with him. You wanna be that person. There's two things you need to do for me. One, since I only got twenty seconds, one, I want you to be yourself. Two, I'ma be me. So with you being yourself, and two, I'ma be me, I'ma need you to do the second thing is figure it out. Oh <laughs> And he's out. FTM people, church.